Have you delivered the amulets? Yes. One arrived too late to protect its bearer. Which? The adventurer. He met a lonely end bitten by a snake. This is sad news. All the same, I consider your debt paid. A sacred island lies farther in the embrace of Mother Nile. Bring me there, and I will tear aside the curtain that shrouds your nightmares. Now, deliver. Tell me what you saw. I saw... I saw what has lain behind my eyes every night for the past year. It begins with a sandstorm. I rise to my feet and walk a corridor of ruins passing into the Hall of Judgment. There, a twin of my son. snake strikes. Ape. Larger than a mountain. Larger than reason. God love a generous soul. A bow of light appears in my hands. I fight the snake and win. Though not without him. A bow of light appears in my hands. I fight the snake and win. Though not without injury. Then I rise through dark, choking waters to surface among lotus flowers. I claim my lost heart from an altar and travel to the field of reeds. In the distance, I see my son. When I reach for him, he turns to ashes. He? Thus is your true seeing unbound. Here. Here. The sacred island awaits our coming. <laughs> Deliverer, would you be free of the curse that plagues your sleep? There is a ritual that will banish it from your mind forever. Yes. Do it then. Go beneath the waters south of here and bring up the statue of Gnom from the sunken temple of Ramses. With this likeness of the great potter to hand, the ritual can be performed. Bring me the statue that lies beneath the water.
Here is the statue. Hnum, Skalpra of children. He will battle Apep in your place. This ritual needs your mind's strength. Sit by my side and meditate as I speak with the gods. Grow, O oh light. Come forth, O oh light. Rise, O oh light, ascend. O oh light, you who are without, come in. O oh darkness, remove yourself from his eyes. O oh god of seeing, bring in the light to him. O oh Apep, who coils in the abyss. Be turned aside, devoid of moisture, come forth from the stream. As your sail bends to yesterday, accept him as a passenger on your divine ship. Gnum, stand beside him and be his champion. Why do you weep? Your curse is lifted. You have lost a child, so you should understand that a mother's fear never ends. Nor does a father's rage. Fear and rage are fair replies to life's fragility. Please, leave me to my tears. Neb, if you will follow me, we must give her privacy. Is there anything I can do to ease her? Hmm. She has found the ritual protection in an ancient scroll. Only a few ingredients remain to be... I'll find them. Wait, Neb. An impatient soul is a troubled one. My lady needs parts from fresh-killed sacred birds. And would you kindly bring a fertility talisman in blue faience? There is a shop south of the temple basin where such items may be found. I will meet you on the road to the pyramids afterwards. May you prosper. Hunt down a flamingo, a heron, and an ibis. I will get the ritual item first, and then hunt down the birds. Yeah, yeah. No, 
abandoned tomb. The maid servant said there was a shop here. Strange place for a shop. I have not seen your kind in some time, Medjai. We are a rare breed. As are merchants who set up shop in a tomb. My customers appreciate privacy. They do not seem to appreciate variety. My customers know I can provide what they seek. I hope you can do the same for me. May I have a look around? But of course. I'll leave you to browse. Excuse me, but I have some business to attend to. I'll be back soon. Excuse me, but I have some business to attend to. I'll be back soon. An inventory. A talisman in blue faience is listed here. I should keep looking around. And in the second chamber lie the wildly goods of Horapolo and Shesh, to protect them and provide them sustenance. The message is incomplete. I wonder what the rest of it says. Hmm. Nothing of value in this room. Why would the merchant sell such cheap goods here? Ah, she is hiding something. and did not want me to see this part of the shop. These goods must be stolen. A fertility talisman. Tamhotep will be pleased. Chance, I spoke to a priest of Anubis at the temple one day when I went to give worship. He whispered darkly into my ear about Pasheremta. Hinted at a bottle. Oh, oh, oh. Sam! Oh, oh. Of masters of craftsmen, forgive me. I was sure it. Take a few feathers for Tamhotep's ritual. That is all the items. Now to meet Tamhotep on the road to the pyramids.
I found what you need, Tamhotep. The seer spoke truth when he named you Deliverer. My ritual must be performed in the moon shadow at the base of the Pyramid of Josa. Will you guard me and my maid until it is done? There may be dangers on the road as well. Gladly. Then let us ride to the Pyramid and wait until the night unfurls in splendor. Game on you. This is uncertain country. Why not bring more guards? My ritual must remain private. Is that also why we travel off the main road? Yes, it is less safe but more secret. The lack of a son lowers my husband in the esteem of the people. And if they knew of the babes I have lost, his ability to compel the gods would be called into question. There are whispers against him already. My troubles bring shame to him and to me. Nebet, it is not your fault. Hush, Mara. I know you mean to be kind, but the scrolls are clear. The woman is the carrier of the child's sex. I do not believe that, Nebet. Oh, Mara, we have had this conversation before. Let us be quiet now. Thank you. Good idea. I see you! My sword stands between your ritual and any who threaten it. Pata's blessing on you. Every morning of my childhood, my father and I spoke the prayer of the Medjai, a promise to those in need. I am a Medjai. I am a feather in the eagle's wing, a living dagger plunged from the sky into the heart of chaos. I am a truth unknown, a scabbard unfilled, a son of the Nile, and a defender of the people. You cannot kill me. For I walk among the dead. Come forth by day, and I will guide you home. My son should have learned this prayer from me. Fayum. 
I will root out the agents of the crocodile. It seems I'm not the first visitor today. Otifres! Nick is not here. I need to find out where my informant is. Hmm, a lot of damage, but no blood or signs of a fight. Maybe he fled before this happened. Hmm. These scrolls tell me nothing useful. I should check upstairs. Ah, who would have done such a thing? What were you protecting, boy? The child's doll. Oh, I'm gonna kill this naked the other crocodile. Scrolls and ink. Ah, I think that tells me where Hotefres has gone. Wait, feathers. From a messenger pigeon. A letter left behind by my informant. It looks like he fled, but the soldiers caught his servant. The servant is still alive. He'll know where Hotefres is. They'll be holding him at the nearby military camp. and stay quiet. I will get you out of here. send you? No, but I must find him. I need his help to find the crocodile. Will you help me? Hotefres took a trader ship to Lake Moeris. It has a large statue on board and is marked by our symbol. The crocodile has hired mercenaries to find him. Then I must hurry. Get somewhere safe. Be well.
So, now they send a son of Egypt against me. It has been a long time since I spilled so much blood. I was sent by Apollodorus. We share a common interest. Who are you? And what do you want, eh? I'm Bayek of Siwa. And I seek information on the crocodile. The phantom that has brought Fayum to its knees. What could you want with him? He belongs to a group that is destroying Egypt. I intend to hunt every last one of them down. Bayek of Siwa. You don't know what you are up against. The crocodile has transformed not only the land, but the people. Those who do not cower in fear are made to work for him. And you have no idea who the crocodile is? I stole a ledger from a Greek magistrate I suspect of corruption. It should reveal the identity of this crocodile. And if we get it to Apollodorus, we may be able to bring down the whole organization. Where's the ledger now? I gave it to my wife Henut to hide. As long as the Ptolemies think it's with me, my family is safe. That is why I have to stay on the move. Here. This will tell Henut you are a friend to be trusted. It is for my daughter, Shadia. Once you have the ledger, find me at the docks south of Uhemeria. Bayek, take a look around my ship before you go. I keep records of local problems which may have the crocodile at their root. They may interest you as a Magi. and get it running again. Don't worry. I won't let them close down this kitchen. Henut? Yes? Hotefre sent me. I am here to help. And I have your daughter's doll. Great. I was awaiting word from my man. Thank you. Come, eat and we can talk. I will name her Iset, and she will be the protector of all Fayum. Ever since Hotefres got a hold of that ledger, Fayum has been on edge. Soldiers with torches patrol every night, and this aunt's kitchen was practically razed to the ground. They have left Shadia and me alone at least. Hotefres has made sure of that. Where is the ledger now? I instructed our most loyal servant to hide it in our villa. They can search the place as many times as they want. They will never find it. Can you take me there? I have been summoned to the lighthouse for another of their routine investigations. Ah, that may not be safe. The Ptolemaic authorities seem to be working with the crocodile. It happens every few days. Don't worry. They wouldn't dare touch someone in an official position. Shadia. Show Bayek the way to our home. Come on, Uncle Bayek! You can see my house from that roof! Follow me! You are not afraid of heights, are you? Oh. Hey, lead on, little one. I will follow. <laughs> Where did you learn to climb like that? That looks like fun. <laughs> here a lot. Everything looks so beautiful. The people should be happy, but they are not. Don't worry. Your mother and father will look after them. Where is your house? On the hill there. See it? Yes. And soldiers. 
Thank you, Shadia. You should go back to your mother now. It might get dangerous. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. Best not to draw attention here. Hey! Did we find the ledger? Not yet, but it won't be long. The captain is upstairs questioning the servant. Stupid Egyptian flag. Complaints to Alexandria about the administration's practices in Fayum. From Henut. She didn't have much success. No ledger. Maps of settlements in the Fayum. Part of Henut's work. Interesting, but not what I'm looking for. Another of Shadia's dolls. Did Hotefles make this one too? An unfinished letter to the Sobek priests. Scathing. Enut and the cult don't see eye to eye. Get him. Uh, I'll kill you. Die, idiot! Uh, break its wheel! Time to die, Philae. What? Savants try to barricade the doors. They weren't quick enough. Gods! Shadia wrote this. She has the ledger. And I sent her back to her mother. I have to find Henut before the soldiers get to her. Oh, Shadia. What have you done, little one? You cannot play games with the crocodile. Seen Helmut. Is she here? The soldiers just came and took her to the lighthouse. Young Shadia, too. Helmut argued with them, but they would not listen. Something is wrong, isn't it? This has never happened before. Get word to Hotefres. Hurry! Damn all this! Helmut and Shadia are at the lighthouse. I need to get there now! Neck! Neck! Hold there. Yes. 
Shadia. Shadia. It is over. The crocodile has won. The ledger lost. My daughter, my Shadia. He has taken everything from us. He will pay for this. And all those who serve him. None of that will bring Shadia back. No. But at least you'll have the comfort of revenge. We both will. I hope so. I will do anything I can to help you, brother. Has he not been able to tell you anything? Only that there were other men with the soldiers. Large, imposing warriors. One red-haired. Bandits? Soldiers? I believe they were gladiators from the arena in Crocodilopolis. It seems this... this monster uses fighters to do his bidding. I will find this monster, friend. He will die. Gladiatorial arena. So the crocodile recruits from this place for his personal army. I need to find out more about it. Excuse me. What can you tell me about this place? Can't you see? It's an arena for Roman blood sport. Barbaric, if you ask me. But it's found favor with those desperate to forget their troubles. It used to be a temple. It should have been left that way. Oh! 
Ayovikos, the living embodiment of war. His fists are deadlier than any weapon. Beridovix, the loyal servant of death. His scythe will ever reap the unworthy. Hey, Neb, what can you tell me about the men who fight here? Men? These are not men, they're gods. You've never seen such savage warriors. They could break you in half with one strike. Ah. Do any of them have red hair? Gods among gods, have you never heard of the brothers from Gaul? Can't you feel their eyes on you? Their statues are beside me. Now. Are you the owner here? Yes, I am the owner. Felix Martialis. Who are you? Another rough knuckle no name seeking fame? I only want entry to the arena. I heard you have got a fighter worth watching. With red hair? Ah, you mean the Gallic brothers. You heard right. But let me save you some time, camel boy. You cannot afford it. Now piss off before you scare away someone who can. Sir, this man wears a Magi badge. Mehmed what? Ah, I do not even care. Can you fight? You look the part, like a vicious, mangy dog. Nah, nah. I have already got an Egyptian. A huntress from Siwa, who's worth three of you. She frequents the obelisk in the East End if you want an impromptu beating. It is the only way inside this arena. Fight in the streets, and the gladiator can bring you in. So, the Gallic brothers are involved in Shadia's murder. But why are they doing the crocodile's bidding? I need to get inside and learn more. The arena owner mentioned a C1 gladiator to the east at an obelisk. I wonder if I know her. Siwa is a small place. I should go and see. There's the C1. Wait. That looks like... This was a good place to, to prosper. Hmm? <laughs> but I never expected to find you here, Ketsa. <laughs> what can I say? I heard the call of the arena. <laughs> can you believe it? I am a gladiator now. Huh? <laughs> but come, come. Let us talk. And drink. <laughs> I'm telling you, Bayek, I am so close to my dream. If only I was given the chance, I know I could become champion. I mean wealth, luxury, fame. What more could a woman want? Huh? That's why I came to Fayum, to make a new life for myself and bury the past. But I was turned away from the arena doors. <laughs> so you have finally given up trying to put the world to rights. Good. Such things are impossible. Felix is slow to trust outsiders. But do not worry. With my backing, we'll soon be fighting side by side. First, we drink. And in the morning, we can go to the arena for the proper introductions. Eh, it's good to have you here, old friend. Yes, I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. 